Well, Kentucky has their man. Mark Pope was officially introduced as the Wildcats 23rd head coach. It's our top story here on the night team. I'm Alex Dieterer. Rep Arena was jam packed today with fans ready to meet the newest leader of Big Blue Nation. WHAS 11's Kent Spencer and senior photojournalist Alyssa Newton were there for the introduction and show us the excitement he brought to the arena. At first, Mark Pope's announcement of becoming Kentucky's new head basketball coach didn't have much sizzle, but after a few days of it settling in, it's clear this Pope brings new hope to the Cats program. And this day wasn't a coaching announcement. It was a home. Game. It is the greatest honor that I will ever have in my professional for this family career to be able to come back here and do this with you. The difference between the difference between Kentucky and every other program in the country is that this is not my team. It's not even our team. It is our team. Packed house in April, and Mark Pope knew exactly what the Big Blue Nation wanted to hear. I understand the assignment. We are here to win banners. That's what our fans want to hear, that it is about the banners we have in the rafters, and so I'm uh, super proud of him. A special moment he shared with his family. What was it like to see him go through this? Special is this? Oh, well, for, for to watch Mark, it's a dream come true. He loves Kentucky. He's deep in his. I mean, he said it over and over again. But we're just so humbled and excited to be here and to watch all. I mean, come on. Our job as coaches is we get to be shepherds. A not so subtle remark directed right at former teammate and roommate Jeff Shepard, as the crowd chanted one more year for his son Reed. And no surprise at all that uh, that the fans are are, are still um, uh, pulling for him and, and loving on him, and so uh, it was pretty cool. I, I owe Pope one though; he he got me good on that one. He may not have been the Cats' first choice. There was some someone I knew very well that I that had, had conversations and over courses of years that said, "Hey, if it ever, okay, well, let's let's talk about that," and it didn't work. Okay, and he knew that. But he may be the perfect fit for this program. Man, it's unreal. It's like a surreal moment. We won a championship, it felt like that again. I felt like I was winning. Uh, and it was because I know he understands, like you said, the assignment. He's gonna get talent in here. He's gonna have talent he's never had before. He didn't have, that he didn't have at Utah Valley State or BYU. He's gonna have that here. Pressure's on, he said it himself, but man, am I excited about it. C-A-T-S, Cats, Cats, Cats! Ken Spencer, WHAS 11 News.